Hey guys, Steph here. I'm the Secret Slob and I am in the middle of a 21 day massive decluttering project. I hope you've been joining me and tackling your fridge, your bathroom, your junk drawers, and phase one of clothes. I'm gonna do a break from the clothes and we'll hit that again a little bit later for part two. And for now, we're gonna be back in the kitchen and do something that everybody has and mine is especially bad, but I know probably everybody's out there is, or at least it's been there at some point, and that is the Tupperware drawer. <laughs> but that's not all. I'm also going to hit the cooking utensil drawer. So this is the place where you have all your wooden spoons, spatulas, ladles, you know, everything that you use to cook with. Not forks and knives, but you could hit that too if you want. The third thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna pick a cupboard, well, a drawer in my case, in my house, in my kitchen that just needs help. So for me, that is the children's cups drawers. And I'll show you why in a second, because it's out of control. It's like our house is a magnet for more children's plastic cups. We have probably 50 of them. And I don't even know why, we keep using the same like five. I'm gonna go through, through that drawer, but you pick a drawer in your kitchen or a cupboard in your kitchen that really needs help. So yeah, maybe you have too many wine glasses, as if that's possible. Whatever, whatever drawer, you know it's a problem. It's your house, you know. So for today, day five of our massive decluttering project, we are back in the kitchen, Tupperware cupboard, Tupperware drawer, the kitchen utensil drawer, and one other cupboard. And for me, it's my children's cups cupboard. And I know you're laughing because you're like, how many cups could she possibly have? Just wait, it's out of control. Okay, so first things first, Tupperware cupboard. If it doesn't have a partner, like the lid without the bottom or the bottom without the lid, goodbye. If it's stained or broken, goodbye. If I never use it or it's some weird shape or obscure item and I never use it, goodbye. No mercy, no holes bar, everything goes. If I'm not using it, it gone. So I'm gonna get my garbage bag and I'm gonna get my thrift store thing because hey, thrift stores love this stuff. People are always looking for Tupperware, right? I, that's where I buy most of mine. I'm gonna go get that stuff and then I'll get started. Here it is, it is packed to the brim. So every time I start decluttering, I just empty out a drawer or a cupboard or whatever I'm decluttering so I can have a look at everything that I have. Okay, so this is all my Tupperware. It's a lot. Um, it's more than I actually thought it was. So I'm gonna start going through it right now. First I'm gonna wipe out my drawer, start going through it, and then I'm gonna put it all back in and yeah. Hopefully I get rid of a lot of stuff, okay. Once I've assessed what I have, I'm finding the things that don't have a lid or don't have a bottom and just putting stuff in my thrift store bag or my recycle bag and picking the things I actually wanna keep forever. These are my bags to go to the thrift store and I had a couple of like garbage ones and I just put those in recycling and this is my drawer now. Moving on to my cooking utensil drawer. So this is my drawer where I keep all my cooking stuff and it's a total mess as you can see and it's so unorganized and it barely closes. <laughs> are you helping? It barely closes so I'm just gonna pull everything out, put it on the counter and then go through it really quick and get rid of a bunch of stuff. Okay, so it's all emptied out and I've got my bag here for the thrift store so I'm gonna just wipe out the drawer and go through that and then I'll start putting stuff back in here. And I saw separator things at the dollar store so I might go grab those um, later but there is definitely stuff here that I can throw away and get out of my life that I don't use and really there's like six wooden spoons here. Who needs six wooden spoons? It's crazy. And there's my baby. So first I'll get her and then I'll do this and that is why you don't take out more than you can put away at one time because sometimes you can't get back to it. So I'm gonna leave this here for five seconds and go get my baby and come back. I don't even know how I got this many utensils. I guess it's kind of a Christmas gift slash garage sale slash I don't know what problem, but anyways, I have way too much stuff, way more than I even need. And this is the stuff that I determined I actually use. So that drawer is all done. It looks great, not perfect. I think I'm gonna go get some dividers for it to kind of keep everything separate and a little bit more organized. But I got rid of a bunch more stuff. I have this whole bag. 
a few utensils to go to the thrift store. Now I'm moving on to my third drawer, which is the your choice. Um, whichever drawer is a problem for you in your house. For me, it's children's cups of all things, but you'll see. Like I said, cup magnet house. So here is my collection of cups and to-go cups and kids cups. Like I said, it's a problem. So I'm gonna declutter, get rid of a bunch of them and just keep the ones we're using all the time. There's no point in keeping them if you might use them or they were present or whatever. If they leak or you don't like them or you don't use them, just get rid of them. Okay, so this is a bag of cups and stuff I don't use anymore. And so now I have three bags, one from Tupperware drawer, one from my utensils drawer, and one from the cups drawer. And this is my cup drawer now. You guys have no idea how happy this makes me. All right, so I'm all done. I did my Tupperware drawer. And just a quick note, we call it a Tupperware drawer in Canada, and that just encompasses all reusable containers. We just call it that. It's like Kleenex instead of facial tissue. We just call it that. So my Tupperware drawer, my cooking utensils drawer, and that horrible drawer full of cups, which is now like half empty, amazing, um, is decluttered. So I've got a big load of stuff to take to the thrift store now because I have some stuff from the other two days. And I will take that and it'll be out of my life forever. And if I ever need a children's cup, I'm sure there will be some at the thrift store because I'm sure there's other people decluttering theirs like me. Hope you have a wonderful day. I hope you found three really good drawers to tackle in your kitchen. If you don't have a Tupperware drawer, you don't have a cooking utensil drawer, find something else. We all have clutter somewhere. Okay, have a great day, you guys. Talk to you soon. Bye.